This book is called Be Safe Around Strangers. This book is written by Bridget Hales and illustrated by Sylvia Baroncelli. Stranger danger! Stranger danger! Pablo, what are you doing? I'm pointing out all of the strangers, Carlos, so we know who to stay away from. Well, not all strangers are bad, Pablo. Most people are nice, but you do have to watch out for strangers acting strangely. You also have to watch out for people you know who act strangely. I'll give you some tips on the way home. So, Pablo, let's say one of these drivers stop and asks you for directions. Grown-ups aren't supposed to ask kids for directions, so that's strange. You should tell a grown-up. Who should I tell, Carlos? All I see are strangers. This is a crossing guard, Pablo. He is a stranger, but he is also a community helper. People like crossing guards and police officers can help you, so you could tell him. Do you know him, Pablo? I forgot his name. He came to our block party. Okay, what if he offered us a ride? I'd say yes. He's not a stranger. He's the guy from the party. You should say no, Pablo. You only sort of know him. Never get in a car with someone you don't know well. Even if they say your parents said to, don't go. Your parents wouldn't send a stranger or someone you barely know to pick you up. You need a Band-Aid. I see someone inside that house. Maybe they have one. We don't know the people in that house, Pablo. Let's go to the library instead. Could he have a band-aid? Stranger danger! Yes, she's a stranger, Pablo, but this is a public place and she works here. It's safe to ask workers for help in a public place. There, that's better. You can also go to a house where you know the person, Pablo. But remember, even people you know can act strange. Hey, I've got some candy for you kids, Pablo says. I'll be right there. But Carlos says, no thanks, we have to get home. Oh, come on, says the neighbor. Nope, see you later, says Carlos. But we know him, Carlos. He goes to our church. I know, but I feel weird around that guy. I don't want to be with him. I don't want to be with him without a grown-up. I talked to my mom about it. She says it's smart to trust your instincts. But I think we hurt his feelings. He'll be fine. It's okay to tell a grown-up no, Pablo. It's okay to be assertive. Hi, Mom, says Pablo. Hi, Mrs. Gomez, says Carlos. What happened to your knee, Mrs. Gomez asks. I fell in the rain and cut it. We got a band-aid from a stranger, but it's okay because we were in a public place and she was a librarian. Smart thinking, kiddo, his mom says. Thanks, mom. You know, not all strangers are bad.